previously on Code Vein. Is that a greater loss? Yes. Queen's Knight Reborn. Ah, that you ass. Oh, uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> that last left a vestige behind. Someone help me. I want to bring about all of the wishes Cruz had for her people. Wow, look at this place. A path. Is that an, another attendant that I have to fight? Watch yourself. Oh, it is. Enough of that. Back to the video. Okay, we are looking good so far. Did you find something good? I really want to find. I really want to get on that walkway with the freaking that attendant and the missile, though, because uh, uh, I need a save point. Uh, am I gonna get to you? I do not know what awaits us at the end, but I will stand at your side until it is all over. Yeah, I will fight. Hard to hear. <laughs> Yeah, continue the showboat, my guy. <laughs> Fat little good that's gonna do you. Oh no, hey, that was a boss. He restored all of my mis- uh, restored all of my regions back. Nice. There you go. Down boy. Bad dog. Uh, this doesn't look like anything useful. Why would they offer this? Huh. Oh, okay, never mind. I hit him with the back of my sword. It's dead. Thank you. Now it's over here. Ha! That's another- Ah, ugh, ugh, that's a close-up I didn't need. Oops. And it's dead. It was. What's that? Too bad. Ah, he goes to a chest. No wonder there's a ladder down there. Okay, I'll, uh, item as well. I'll be back. I'm just gonna go down here and murder whatever tries to murder me. Like that guy. I knew you were in the- I knew you were dead. I figured there's no- no way that's a trench like this without some form of enemy next to it, or behind it, or on it. Hey, you, get down from there. Nope. There you go, pal. What you deserve. Thank you. Bye-bye. What's in this? GXL Defender plus 9. Highly resistant to the elements, except for fire, I'm assuming. <laughs> that was what I can see. Uh... Ugh, it doesn't really look that great for Nothing me. Nothing is more important than preparedness. Oops. That elevator leads to our destination. Nothing Document gets here. You, huh? Look at that. Yay! Now we can go back and complete that side quest with through that guy. First, I just want to break everything here to make sure I, I'm not missing anything. Uh, yep, I was You've right. Got sharp senses. Something up here, yeah. How far down are we now? I have Why no idea. In the first place? After, that is the which I Look at that. Part F. I think that's what I need for that particular vest vestige as well. Let's go down here. Don't know where this goes though, or if any of these guys are alive or dead. So I'm just gonna. Well, why is it magnetizing over there? Uh, where the hell am I? I think this. Wait, hold on. Where am I? Oh, this is like part of the um. This place is new. This is part of the. Hold on, I need to figure. I need to remember where this door goes. Oh, it's down here. So this goes all the way back to the central missile. That's right. Okay, we don't need this. Not now. Okay, so we just click down then. Okay, nothing else for us down here. So we're gonna head back across this bridge. Sorry. I was looking at something. I saw your cape. I saw your cape move, pal. Yeah. So like, for those for those sleeping enemies that are playing dead, if their capes move, that means they're enemy. They're actually enemies. If they don't move, well, that means they're actually they're actual corpses. Oh, there's another room over here. Says the map. Whoops. Uh oh. This is a place I haven't been before. Oh. Hey! This looks difficult. Aha! Backstab! Oh, that, that didn't do a lot. What, heavy attack. Yeah, I can do that too. Ow. 
So close to hitting him. Ooh, yes, Iba. Uh, Iba. <laughs> Io, do it. Probably because both the names start the start. This, the, both names start like the syllable I. I for Iba. I for Io. Ah, you're too tall, you can't hit me. And it's dead. Yay! Ding. There's an NPC? Wait, what? Where? Where is this NPC at? Oh, this looks promising. They found something valuable today. A pure of blood. I see something there. Ah, yes, this is where that missile goes. Okay. So that's, um, that's a spiky death over there. So let's, uh... uh Okay, we didn't trigger it. Nice. Uh, I guess it's left for us to do, but actually go back to that elevator and um, do the thing with the thing and the thing and the thing. Got a regen activation factor though. Thank you. It's a plus six now, I think. It will basically restore like a shit ton of health. So let's go back down to this elevator and then let's continue hey, the story. Hi. I've been waiting for you. Ah yes. Please. This See must lead to the boss. For me. Oops. Here we go. Let's prepare that. Wow, that's creepy. <laughs> It's a, it's a crypt, I think. Forgive me, my successor. I promised that I would defend you as your attendant. It was my duty. But I could not prevent your frenzy. In the end, I failed you. And they got turned to ash? I could do nothing more than watch as your death finally came for you. Why was I even here? What purpose did I serve? I... Damn. That is quite needlessly tragic. These poor attendants are just created for one singular sole purpose and then... Once their purpose is either complete or their charge is dead, then they just sort of fade. It's kind of sad, really. Give this attendant lost their successor to Frenzy and then succumb to it themselves. If all we can do is stand by and watch, while we lose the ones we've been charged to protect, then does our presence serve any purpose? As attendants, what good do we do? I mean, you've been real helpful with that spear of yours. <laughs> And all the, um, the magic that you sling. Yeah, if you start this other message for me, please. Thank you. It looks like another crypt. There's probably like other successors too in the story. If I am able to ease your suffering, even if it is only by the smallest amount. And I would gladly sacrifice myself to do so. After all, that is the duty with which I have been entrusted. My reason to be. That is really, really tragic. For now and always. Yeesh, man. Just yeesh. Well, only thing left to do but go forward. I think with that we got actually all the vestiges to meet the good ending. Just the uh, ending that I was aiming for. Is it really meant to be this way? Do all attendants have to sacrifice their lives for the sake of their successors? Not really. I mean, you've been doing just fine. It does not seem right. You've been fine, Ayo. But could it be that I'm mistaken? You're not mistaken. Don't you worry, Ayo. Right, get in here. That's a powerful sign. That's, uh, that's the beginning and the end right here. Oh, there's a bunch of attendants here. Hi, guys, girls, ladies. 
So what's up? I cannot understand. The actions you've chosen to take, they can bring nothing but further disaster to this land. I cannot allow that mistake to repeat itself a second time. Stand by their side and attend to them. That is enough. It is the duty with which we have all been entrusted. If you lose your way, if you take one false step, it will lead to that same result. That's not true. Yes, as attendants, it may be that we were all born from Cruz's weakness. But we are not all identical to one another. Our experiences are unique. Through our journeys, I have experienced the memories of so many different people. I have witnessed the passion with which they lived their lives. And what I've found for every single one of those people is that they fought as hard as they could to survive. They pushed themselves for the sake of others to keep living. It didn't matter if they had lived as a human or if they had lived as a revenant. They still struggled on. It was the same for the successors, just as it was for so many of our poor sisters. I do not wish to cling to a futile mission out of fear and let myself stand by, hoping for a peaceful ending. I will struggle. I will fight against Cruz's sin and against my duty. Is what a part of what it means. Oh, hey, there's a there's a error in tran error in the grammar over here. Well, that's part of what it means to really be alive. What it means to be alive. Eo, it's true, there does seem to be something different within you. Something that sets you apart from the other attendants. Very well. I bequeath all to you. And so, I beg of you. Please, save everyone. Oh, well, she's dead. And all of them are too. Wow. It's like they were just holding on, waiting for that one moment for someone to come and set them free from their misery. We go together. Yes, Io. We go together. Into whatever madness awaits us. Never mind. Let's move. Never mind. No madness. It's the jail of, blood of the stagnant blood. Watch your step. Think about oh, jeez, Louise. That is a lot of blood. Good God, look at this place. This missile here. So we'll use it. Now let's use that nearly one million haze to level up, get some upgrades, get a little by tiny boost to health, and let's confront Silva. Hey, big guy, we're here to put you out of your misery. Okay, he's a wolf. <laughs> Whoa, those are big swords. <laughs> oh, jeez, look at the size of those things. Ah, yes. Well, this is probably the single biggest, most difficult fight I'll ever be in. Leave this to me. No, 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 no. We, we, we're, we're doing this together. Oof. Ow. 
Just this will. Healing while I, while I recover. I think he's charging up, is he? Yep, he is. Nope. Here, Ayo, have this. For their howl thing. Oh no, he has. He doesn't. Never mind. No, you don't. Oh, that hurt. Yep. Ooh, that healed up almost all of my health. Damn. Ow! Thanks for that, Ayo. It's gonna stink. Oh. Heal. Well, I mean, I blocked most of that. Do it. Oh. Ow. Stop freaking blinking around, you jerk. Oh, that was close. Yeah, I would. I don't have space. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Sorry, Silver. Release your vestiges. Probably a stage two, isn't there? Yep. No. Silva has lost control of the relic. Ooh. Oh, that hurts. Oh, what's wrong? Silva is pulling in the relics. Ah, yeah. Oh. Wait, so Lu. Wait, Lu. Louis, Yakumo, and me were also successors? Huh? Yep, there's def- yep, I knew there was gonna be a stage 2 to this boss. Come on, dude, we're just trying to help you. Get a stage two. Oh, that is freaky. That is really freaky. Is that a dragon? It is. Oh, that is not a dragon. Never mind. It's a, it's a boss from Monster Hunter. No, I refuse to let the world end here. I speak. I swear, I will stop this. I speak finally. Oh no, that's Jack and Jack and Eva. Yep, nope, it didn't give me back my regens. Come on then. Oof. Oh, that hurt. Oh, I still got hit by it. Dang it. Oh. 
So it's possible to stagger this thing, yeah? Oh, that I'm dead. Alright. Ow. I need to remember to run when he charges at the purple thing. Dead again. I hope help. Huh. Uh oh, that's not good. Oh darn it! Hey, Miss Sybil, welcome back. As you can see, I am struggling <laughs> because this camera is shitty. <laughs> Ow! It still hit me. Damn. What's going on? The camera's being a nuisance. Camera, stop being a nuisance. I can't see what's going on half the time. You're trying to attach yourself, attach yourself to its chest. Ah, oh, that hurt. And I'm dead. Wait, no, I'm not. Yeah, I can see that. What the hell is going on? Oh, well, 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 we're both dead. Oh, well, at least it puts me back. Um, waiting for you. At least it puts me back at the second stage of the boss instead of having me. Instead of making me do the whole thing all over again. <laughs> Big ugly. No you don't. I probably just... I would be better off just not locking my camera to it at all. Oof. That hurt. Oh god, oh god, oh god, ah! <laughs> Darn it. Keep getting it has that attack. Oof. I don't have any stamina boosters. Darn it. Oh no, that's just it's doing its second phase thing. Okay. Okay, I have learned now there is almost no dodging that. So, um. Pick up. Ah, you can hit me, you're too, you're too big. Ow, never mind. Oh crap. Oof. Darn it. Well. I don't know how to dodge that at all. You have my thanks. to work. Oh, 
Dang it. Ugh. Missed. Okay, I just gotta stay under it this time, I think. Ow! Okay, that didn't work. Yeah, I can. Yes! <laughs> Got him! Second try. Well, second try. Suck it, bitch! I still need to restore his memories, though, so he can continue being our friend and not some eight faced monstrosity. Regenerating? We don't have a lot of time. Quick. Hey, kid, can you handle this? Yes, I can. What? Yes, Mia? Don't worry, I can handle it. It's fine. Hey, ugly. I could use a look inside of you. It's all right. Hey. Huh? Ayo, what are you doing? Ew. Even if I serve as little more than an empty vessel, you have stored so many precious memories inside of my heart, and I promise I will never allow them to fade away. Whatever happens, I will always be with you. Just as you will always be within my heart. And now... Goodbye. Wait, did you just take all of the relics into herself? Yeah, she did. Wow, that's a lot of relics. Damn. That's eight of them. No, seven, sorry. I thought I counted. I thought I counted eight. What? The relics? Oh, there was one in me as well. Huh. We were talking. The other successors, and Emily. And Louis' sister, too.
we gotta do now is wait up. Oh. Well, we're back at the home base. Who are these people? We finally secured a steady supply of blood beads. Once again, we have Eo to thank. Karen? On the day she took all of the relics, I was suddenly my old self again. Oh! And ever since then, she's been producing blood beads and even maintaining the red mist. You're, um... So even if it's only a little... Louis' sister! I make it so people can have normal lives in this world she's protecting for us. Here we got Nicola! That's my wish. We got Nicola back, we got Aurora. Is Emily over there? Ooh, nice. I plan to start research with Karen that will hopefully lead to methods for controlling thirst and revenants. I don't know if we'll ever find an answer, but I'm sure it will lead to better lives in the Jail of the Mists. It would be nice if Louis could work with us. I mean... In the years after Eo stopped the relics from frenzying and transformed into the Weeping Tree, Karen and the others discovered a reliable source of blood beads. And the question I've pondered for so long, what as a revenant can I do? What about the outside world and the horrors there? Hmm. We analyzed the signals intercepted from outside when the Red Mist appeared. There were countless cries for help. As revenants, we prey upon humanity. We might bring them nothing but misery. Even so, I can't just give up. Huh. Let's go talk to all the people. Hey, Nicola. Now you don't get All the power was sucked right out of my body. I was so big and strong. But now look at me. But now Jack's training me to grow strong again. I don't see Mia as much as I used to, but I always feel close to her, even when we're apart. Mia is standing like right there in the I courtyard. I think it's because we respect each other so much now. I miss her, but a knight has his duty. Um, you know, she, you know, she's just standing like right over here. You know that, right, Nicola? Kid, hello. Hey. I've looked through documents from the Great Collapse, and the more I read. The more I understand why those creatures are called horrors. They're immune to even the most powerful weapons, and immortal like the loss that plagued the Jail of the Mists. Hmm. Now I understand why Revenants had to be created. The situation was that dire. Huh. And the horrors are still roaming the outside world. It must be incredibly difficult living out there. So like, pretty much... Revenants and what's left of humanity in this bubble are kind of safe, pretty much. The relic's power created the Weeping Tree, thanks to Eo's wish. And there's no sign of the Queen coming back. It must have taken a strong will. We are ordinary Revenants without the power of the relics. But our mission still remains. As long as I live, I will continue to watch over that power. Together with Jack. Good. Hey, Jack. There are no changes in the Weeping Tree. It's completely normal. Don't worry. If anything happens, I swear I'll do everything in my power to stop it. Meanwhile, it's time we both do what we need to. My mission as a Watcher has ended, but my duty to protect the world still remains. I won't allow the hell here to escape and torment those outside. So we're just gonna murder everything in the uh, general facility. Hey, Yakumo, how are you feeling now that your, uh, your best friend is alive again? I'm glad to see that things have calmed down a bit here. Although Louie's worried again. Are the two of you ever satisfied? You finally earned some peace, so why not enjoy it? Well, whatever you choose, I'll go along with you. Do what you feel is right. Okay, you don't have nothing to say about Emily, that's fine. Today I invited Yakumo to work for the provisional government, but he turned me down outright. Sorry, but just like you've got things you want to do, I've got things I want to do too. Yeah, he hasn't changed a bit. <laughs> well, I didn't want to work for them at first either. After a while of fighting to survive, I noticed I'd made a bunch of friends along the way, and here I am stuck with them. But I guess they're all pretty great, so I don't regret it at all. Huh. Davies, anything? The lost are still a Davis. dire threat to the survival of humanity. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. The lost are still a dire threat to the survival of humanity, but the new provisional government is at last on a course to stop them. Silva is pushing reforms to aid as many revenants as possible. Oh, he's still alive. Huh. I can finally get to the job of exploring the depths in earnest. You've been a great help. I must thank you. I guess after we restored oh, all the everything, forgot. we I have brought a Silva back from his um, relic <clears throat> corrupted state. Uh, the provisional government would appreciate your cooperation. Please contact the government if you seek work with real meaning. <laughs> real meaning? Seriously? 
Is that amber blood bead Eo gave you all right? It's a piece of her memory and a manifestation of her strength. Handle it with care. Karen and the others say it's made of the same substance as the weeping tree Eo gave us after taking on all the relics. It has the ability to alter the relic's influence, if only in a small way. Huh. All right, Coco. This garbage heap may just have become a slightly better garbage heap. That means people have less use for what I'm selling. <laughs> I'm only joking. Don't worry about me. Do your thing, okay? Okay, I will. Uh, I think that's the end of the game right there. <laughs> Got the good ending and now all, this, all that I can do is just the, um, the dungeons. Leave base and depart out of the red mist. Note, you will be unable to return here. Ooh, I can leave the base. 